yes, I'm in the same clothes because I'm on a roll and I wrote all these trainings down when I was on an airplane because I knew what I had just learned needed to be shared and this fire and stirring inside of me needed to be out quickly. So all these trainings, I'm wearing the same thing because it's the only day that I actually get halfway ready because it's Sunday. So I want to focus on what sacrifices are you willing to make? Y'all, there's going to be sacrifices in this business. There's going to be sacrifices at anything that you do because you're willing to change and you want to change, right? So there's going to be sacrifices coming your way. And you're like, yes, I know, Cassie. I know I'm not going to be able to watch Netflix or I know I'm not going to be able to um, have a lot of date nights or I mean have date nights. But you know what I mean? Like there's going to be sacrifices, and most of the time, it's not going to be binge watching certain things or um, being able to have a lot more play dates. You can, you know, still have some, but maybe you're you're saying no to a lot more things because you are willing to make sacrifices to the end goal. Um, great example that was brought up in class: um, college degree. Maybe some of you have it, right? A lot of us, it took what two, four years to get our college degree. We for sure heck made a lot of sacrifices, right? I remember sitting up, drinking, not some great, some drinks, like rock stars, monsters, all the things, to be able to stay up as late as I could to get a paper done, or to get a graphic design project done, or to get a C on a test that I knew that that's probably all I was going to get. But I was making sacrifices of sleep. I was making sacrifices of um, friendships because I had a goal and I had to finish my degree to be able to be back with my husband. You know, we, we were at a point where I only had a year left of school. He lived in one city and I lived in another. And I, you know, we made those sacrifices to help me finish my degree because that is what was happening in our lives at that moment. My, my, my credits weren't going to transfer. It was a whole mess, but we made sacrifices to get to where we are now. And we forget, we forget about that in this business. It's like, oh, this, you know, we're not, we, we make excuses. But yet, if you think of it like a college degree, remember all the things that you did and you fought for for that degree. Remember everything that you did and you fought for. If you don't even have a college degree, find something that you fought for and you sacrificed, whether it was your job, whether it was, you know, a team or something that you're doing right now that you're sacrificing because... Heck, you're trying to get um, a new job and you're staying up late taking tests and things so you can pass to get the certification or whatever. You're making tons of sacrifices for the long-lasting benefits that are about to come. It's the exact same thing. Becoming a mom. Heck, that's the best thing that I can analog analogize, whatever. We make lots of sacrifices that we take, like being able to, <laughs> having lots of mom buns, taking showers every day. Um, you know, having spit up on our, on our, when we, when our babies were little, you know, all the things that happen as a young mom, we make tons of sacrifices, you know, working full time. You know, if you're working full time, you're making sacrifices for your family right now. And you're making sacrifices. They're going to be long term. Your children are watching you and you are making those sacrifices. So what sacrifices were made in all of that? Think about that. Like what sacrifices are you making right at this moment? in XYZ or that you did in XYZ. What were they? What did they look like? Like literally write those down. That's that's the challenge. Write those down right now. Write those that you are going through and you're like, you know, sacrifice one. Well, I remember in college, you know, I sacrificed sleep. I sacrificed being with my husband at the time. I sacrificed relationships. I, you know, I sacrificed having good grades. You know, I I did a lot because I was I was in two different places. I had to always drive to go see my husband. So I knew in, in some things I wasn't going to have an A. But I was making that sacrifice because I needed relationship with my husband still. But I also needed to finish school. So there was a lot of things that I was saying no to. But I knew that there was an end result coming my way. So what do you want in your life? What do you want it to look like? Will it come with sacrifices to get it there? Because with growth, growth becomes responsibility. If we want to grow, we have to be responsible. We have to be responsible with our time. We have to be responsible with our children, our marriage, our balance, and everything. Think of those sacrifices you made 
What sacrifices are you going to make right now to get to your why, yours, your goals, your dreams, everything? Because I promise you, there's going to be sacrifices to get to you, to get you to your end result. What is that going to look like? And what are you going to start doing right now to make that happen?